This video is about creating and using custom geology symbols to use in QGIS. One way to use custom symbols in QGIS is to make scalable vector graphics in Inkscape, which is free and good software, and apply them to your GIS data. Here I'll show you one way of doing this to create geological symbols like strike and dip of bedding, and lineations, and joints. However, you can use these principles to make and apply whatever custom symbols you want. Here are three files that I've previously created for joints, lineations, and bedding. Note that they are scalable vector graphics, which is the native format that Inkscape uses. They can also be created using applications that are not Inkscape, whether free or purchased. Opening these SVG files in Inkscape shows them to be simple line drawings and in this case I have them on a page that's 500 pixels by 500 pixels. Here's one that I've made for joints, bedding and lineations. But as I mentioned you can make any shapes you want in here and then use them in QGIS. Note that these Inkscape drawings are really very simple. If we select, for example, the bedding uh, group here and right click and ungroup, see that it's just one short line there and a longer line there. Note the file path that I've put them in, which is the programs files, QGIS apps, QGIS SVG, and then I've got a geology folder in there. I have them in there because uh, when installed, QGIS uh, makes this SVG folder, so it makes sense to put them in the same place, but really you can put them anywhere you want. So to use these symbols in QGIS, you'll need to watch my other video, which is linked in the description below. I hope this has been helpful. Uh, please leave any comments below and subscribe to see my other videos.